Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. You never want it because it's Tazimo. You want it? Oh, it's because Tazimo sucks. Tazimo doesn't suck. Tazimo sucks. No, it does not. All right, so it's go to free con print free conferencing dot liveoffice dot com, and then you sign up. You could actually use my. You sign up for free, basically, and gives you instant access. Or you could use the account that I had already set up. When you log in, essentially, you'll get this interface, and you'll see a little button that says Web Manager. Mm -hmm. You click that. You send the person that you want to conference in the, n the number, and then what they call the bridge number. So they dial a phone number, then they type in the bridge number, and then they're brought into the... Web Where manager. Where do I get the number to give them? The, I'll forward it to and you. And the bridge number. The bridge number is it's it's in the it's account. It's a new one every time. No, it's the same one. Oh. You always give out the same one, so you don't have to worry so about. So do I always give out the same eight hundred number and the same bridge number and say call me at this time? Yeah, but it's not an eight hundred number. Oh, why is that? It's a regular number. But most people have like ultimate or like unlimited <laughs> long distance anyway. So I have to make them pay. Well, they won't have to pay. Because most people either use a cell phone or they have like unlimited. No, they most people have unlimited long distance plans anymore. They're not gonna. It'll be fine. Trust me. So then, basically, when you're in there, well, let's let's start one. Here, let me post something to uh, Twitter. Um, so our account information is here. I'm already logged in, so I don't have to worry about like going through the whole thing again. So basically, there's the conference dial-in number one two one eight two one eight. 486-1300, Conference Bridge, 513-332. So, testing, okay, what should we pick? We could do like a subject, like talk about something. What was on Tech Meme today? Something hot, something, oh, well, never mind. <laughs> <sighs> uh, that sucked. <laughs> Uh, yeah, they moved, it looks like. Uh, Microsoft. No, CDRM anything free music. but techie stuff. Pick something that's not techie. Well, then what? You think about it. Well, Let's ask them what they did for exercise today. Yeah, but no one's going to call in and say what they exercised about. Why? No, what did they do for exercise? Did they run? Did they do Pilates? Did they do aerobics? What did you do for exercise today, hon? Nothing. I All typed. Right. Right. Showing off free teleconference to Ponzi. Call in now. Every phone. We want to know. We want to know what you did for exercise today. Discussion point. Discussion point. What do you do for exercise? Yeah, How's that? Okay. Good. All right. Uh, I'm going to type it on the web interface for Twitter because the IM doesn't work very well. Where's Pixie? Pixie? Sniffing over there. Pixie Relic. Pixie. Come here, Pixie. Come here, Pixie. Come here. Okay. So I press. So now I've sent it out. So they have. They have the information, or they will any minute. Wait, I'll flip back to here. Oh, we've got a call in. Oh, duh. Yeah. Okay, so. Really? Oh, trust me. Oh, crap. 218. <gasps> yeah, but where is it? Oh, great. 218. 486. 486. 1300. 1300. Conference Bridge. 513. Why does it say in use? Welcome to live office conferencing. Please enter your six digit bridge number. The conference is not started. If you are the moderator, please enter your you four-digit pin number? to open the conference. Yeah, I will, I will. Okay, so now I've joined the conference. I press refresh in the web interface, mm -hmm. and there I am. Now, it already knows my name because I've already dialed in the number. Okay. So as people, as the same people dial in, I just press this name, and I can change the name, and I can just choose Remember Me so that if the same person keeps calling from the same number over and over again, I'll get it. So it's been posted to Twitter. But I don't know if anybody is necessarily going to get it. Or, from here, you can dial out the participant. Now, before people come in... Conference recording started. So now it's started. Now there's another Hi, person that's... Hello! Who, who, who's just joined us? 
Hello? Hello? Jay, uh, this is Jay, also known as Cosmo G. Space, the Unabomber. Oh, Unabomber. Cool. Hi, Jay. Yeah. So, did you exercise today? Does lifting the bomb count? <laughs> <laughs> no. Those were arm lifts, right? <laughs> so, you heard the, you heard yeah, the, yes. you heard it go, da-da, that means someone's joined us. If you if you wanted to, you Chris could... Chris teaching me how to use the conference call stuff. So right now, Jay, you're the only person who's called in. Yeah. So I started the recording. Oh, okay. Jay joined, and then I can choose enable name announce. And what that'll do is the next if if I enable that, the next person who calls in it'll go da da join blah 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 joining the conference, whatever they say their name is. Okay. So that way you know who's who's joining. Do you ever use this kind of stuff? Conference calling. Yeah, I have before some of the. Low tech stuff. Chris, do you have like a web uh, control panel for this? Yeah, it's actually freeconferencing.liveoffice.com. I found it the other day and it, it works out pretty well. It's pretty easy actually. And then it'll record it and uh, then we'll upload it to it'll upload it to the web automatically and give you the MP3 download for it. So then you just oh, save it and cool. then put it wherever. Huh? Yeah, that is cool. So it's kind of like an automatic I podcasting phone recording system. So I'm trying to find something new for exercise that I like, but I don't know if lifting a bong will do it. Well, you know, I, I should have done more, but I was pretty busy today. <laughs> what do you usually like to do? Um, I, I, I figure if I'm going to exercise, I have to do it cheap and easy. So I got myself one of those cheap step incline machines and I put it in the bedroom in front of the television. That's that way I can do it in the morning and at night a little bit. All right. Well, I was just like, showing. I, I was basically. I'd like to say. <laughs> See, I told you talking about exercise was going to be a bust. But thank you, I Jay, know. for calling thank in. Thank you for calling. I really appreciate it. Okay. Well, I'll get out of here. I got another call coming in anyway. Cool. Okay. See ya. Night. I'll catch you guys later. All right. Okay, bye. bye. So that's it. I just hung up, so I'll be disconnected here in a second, and then Jay not connected, so he's off. So we're both gone. Now, at this point, the conference is basically over. So there's nothing to record. It's done. So then I can close that window. And then here in the Are podcast recording. Are you recording recordings. this so that I can look at this later? Yeah, I'm recording it. I'm recording it right but not there. But the, not the screen. Okay. Why do I need, you don't need the screen. You just type in your information. Okay. Bridge, pin, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. I'll forward you that information. But don't share that pin with anybody because then anybody can get into your conference and stuff. Okay. So then here's an untitled recording that. Will I get a new pin every time? No, it's the same pin, same bridge, same number. That's what makes it easy. Oh. So you, so you can like use it for business, your fun, or whatever. So here's the, an earlier one that I recorded. Nice. Well. Here. Chris Abraham. Hey, my name's Brian Rudewald. That's, That's when I just kind of threw it out. Where are you at? I threw it out and just said, hey, everybody kind of call in. So then it's saved. Then I can press launch, and it'll actually download the MP3, which would be pretty big. But that's how you do it. That's It's it's that easy. And then you, you're all talking on the phone, so that way there's no complicated setup and everything. You're just having a phone conversation. Cool. Uh, that's about it. All right, then. And wh it'll, where do I save it? I have to find a spot to save it in? We'll save it on your hard drive somewhere. No, I mean if I want to post it to the web. Yeah, save it on your hard drive somewhere. I don't know why they do this. The, art, the way they handle the podcasting system isn't very good. When it comes to that, just give it to me or Andrew. So can I put it somewhere in the web, though, and someone else can get it, and but only the per people that I want to get it? That you just want to get it? Well, if that's the case, then you would just get, send them this URL. Okay. It's already there. But I would say that if you're going to use it to record like stuff for your own to redistribute as a podcast, then you download it and then put it on your own whatever podcast service that you use. That's essentially it.